hello friends so today's video topic is if you are unable to install windows 10 or windows 11 and you are getting this kind of error window windows cannot be installed required files make sure all files required for installation are available so to fix this issue you have to convert your partition to MBR and I will show you how to do it first cut this window cut this error window open windows startup screen and click on this option repair your computer then click on troubleshoot then click on command prompt now you have to type a few commands to repair this issue so the first command is disk part press enter now type the next command list space disk press enter so as you can see uh, I have two disks right now. Disk 0 is my internal hard drive of 320 GB and disk 1 is my USB pen drive which is right now connected with my laptop. So you have to select your internal disk of 320 GB. So the command will be select space disk space. Now you have to type the disk number so my internal hard drive of 320 GB and the disk number is 0 so I have to type 0 press enter now you have to type the next command clean this command will delete all the data from your hard drive so if you have any important data in your hard drive take the data backup first otherwise type this command press enter disk part succeeded in cleaning the disk now type the final command convert MBR so this command will convert your drive to MBR press enter that's it successfully converted the selected disk to MBR format now cut this window and after that click on this option turn off your PC and then start the installation process again so let's do it again open this windows setup again then click on next to start the solution click on install now select the windows edition depends on you then click on next accept click on next click on custom so this is the hard drive i have 320 gb and right now it is in unallocated space so select the space then click on new so i will create two partitions so this is my first partition now i will create another partition So I have created two partitions then click on next to install the window. So as you can see the error has been removed. So this is how you can fix this error. This is all for the video. Thank you.